mark on your on your elevation. Okay, so we got the tree, and then oh, there's a so down to the left there's that rock. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Come on, boy. Thank you. Yep. yep go ahead. <laughs> And um, so this is uh, kind of like a modern take on, or, or our take on the Mark 12. Um, we built a, uh, a clone correct replica that we presented to Marcus Luttrell of Lone Survivor in November. And dude, it was the gnarliest experience because like we found all these photos of his gun. And so like some of the customizations that he put into it, we put into it and like, and then we completely replicated his uh, his his rattle can in Serico and like replicated all the wear patterns and everything like that. And so he opens up the case and he's just like, holy shit, mama, I haven't seen you forever. And I was just like, ah, I love it. And <laughs> and, uh, and the way that he was just manipulating it, I was just like, I, I love that reaction. So, um, so this is our take on that uh, that uh, SPR or Mark 12 cool. type rifle. Uh, it comes in 16 or 18. Um, this is an 18 inch barrel, full length Arca um, handguard on the bottom. Beautiful. Um, the UBR Gen 2 stock and uh, a carbine buffer system with the, with our gas and our our, uh, um, our proprietary gas and Beautiful. barrel. And we do the upper and lower in house. Um, this one is kind of like on a price point in between the DMSR and the LSS. Okay. Um, this one is uh, focused on like coyote hunting, environment hunting, and uh, you know the uh, predator control, that kind of stuff. Um, Devin and his crew are using it for tactical games. Um, so this week uh, they had they've had their rifle for a couple weeks and they were out really putting it through its paces mm -hmm. this week and uh, they had a six inch target at 700 and he's like dude I sent a full mag didn't miss a single round this thing is this thing is amazing and we're like yeah it's kind of boring like you just kind of point it where you want it to go and it yeah. just kind of goes there you know that's awesome <laughs> so cool. um especially as a lefty yeah pay attention to like the gas in your face that's the biggest thing for me so. yeah for sure Okay, do something a little further. That's, that's you see this big wash right yeah. here on that that's tree? The yep. On the bottom left, there's a white rock that kind of stands out above the others. Okay. Um, you'll probably be on the first or second mark on your on your elevation. Okay. So we got the tree, and then oh, there's a so down to the left, there's that rock. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Come on, boy. Thank you. Yep. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> what I, that's what I make and I can use it. You know, I gotta be saying. Oh, that's awesome. I think you're about 300 right there. Wow. Maybe a little less than 300. Um, and that rock is about a six inch rock. Nice and smooth, right? Smacking it. So all of these rounds that you just shot were 25 cents a piece, right? Right. Um, versus a dollar a piece for you know, or two dollars a piece uh, for Creedmoor or 308. And so like this is a great place for people to start. They're like, I want to get into long range shooting. You're you know two grand into the rifle, but then. Um, you know your uh, your your ammo savings as you're learning how to hold you're learning how to do your hold offs you're learning how to do your dope you're yep. you're learning how to build your sheet your uh, your dope charts and all that kind of stuff like this is a great place to start that's you know sub two thousand dollars and then cheap to actually shoot and learn because this is just you know this is just remanufactured ammunition most of these rifles are all half MOA or or better um, it just as part of our our manufacturing process I mean it's a, it's an interference fit of the of the uh, the barrel extension and the receiver extension um, you'll notice like there's not rattle there's not you know give um, it's just solid dead and that's what you want and that's why there's that's why they're all so accurate everything that we build from the patrol on up is all built in the same manner and the price point just changes as far as components and the stuff that goes into it right so the MSR um, takes a lot more tuning and a little bit more attention to detail and then it's a very very specific barrel profile that we're looking for very very specific gas port and then uh, and then our proprietary a5 system and buffer and recoil system in the back um, but uh, yeah that's, that's awesome well hey thank you so much for